A lot of fitness influencers tell you to take at least 5G of creatine powder daily to grow muscle. You must know that it is not going to work and you won't grow any muscles even if you take 5G of creatine daily. And here's why. Firstly, taking creatine daily without working out heavily in the gym won't yield any results in building muscle. And as seniors over 60, you cannot afford to lift heavy weights in the gym like someone in their 40s because of injury risk. Secondly, for people who take creatine, they are required to drink at least 2 L of water daily or even more. Drinking this amount of water daily is very unrealistic for seniors. As we age, our kidneys don't work as efficiently as they used to, and such a large amount of water would lead to frequent nighttime urination. This in turn affects the quality of your sleep and you need quality sleep to build muscle. That's non-negotiable. So this brings us to the next obvious question. If creatine is not the best option for seniors looking to build muscle, what vitamin is and why? In this video, I'll answer that and tell you two vitamins you must drink first thing in the morning before breakfast to build muscle. I'll start with the simplest one that works very quickly in just hours and then reveal the best one last. I'll also share three foods you're eating right now that are stopping you from building muscle as you age. If you haven't subscribed yet, do so right away. Without further delay, let's begin. Number one, vitamin C. Creatine is one of the most researched supplements in the world, helping with muscle saturation and hydration in such a way that when you start taking creatine, your muscles soak up the creatine like a sponge. Not only that, they pull in water. That's why people who drink creatine, their weight tend to go up a pound or more. Also, the water in your muscles from taking creatine actually helps your muscles perform better. But here is something that most seniors miss about creatine. Unlike creatine, vitamin C offers a broader range of benefits that go beyond muscle energy. It acts as a powerful antioxidant, protecting muscles from damage after walks or light workouts while also stimulating collagen for stronger joints and connective tissues. Vitamin C boosts immunity, supports muscle recovery through reduced inflammation, and is gentle on the kidneys, making it safer for seniors. It also promotes better sleep quality by preventing nighttime dehydration and is easily accessible through fruits, vegetables, or simple supplements. In short, vitamin C helps the body repair, recover, and rebuild naturally without the heavy training or high water intake creatine demands. Taking vitamin C before breakfast is one of the simplest ways seniors can support real muscle growth naturally on an empty stomach, it's absorbed faster, allowing it to start repairing worn muscle fibers right away. It also helps your body use protein from breakfast more efficiently, turning it into strength instead of fat. By reducing inflammation and soreness from your daily walks, it speeds up recovery and keeps you active longer. Recent research followed over 13,000 adults between ages 42 and 82 for several years, those with higher vitamin C levels, both from food and supplements, had significantly more muscle mass than those with low vitamin C intake. Even among seniors over 65, the difference was clear. Vitamin C helped them maintain stronger muscles and recover faster from daily activities. Or try out some of these natural sources of vitamin C. Start your morning with a fresh orange or grapefruit, both packed with more vitamin C than most people get in an entire day. Then blend a smoothie with kiwi, pineapple, and a handful of spinach. This combo floods your muscles with antioxidants that repair tissue damage from your daily walks. Here's the game changer. Squeeze fresh lemon juice over your lunch or mix it into your water bottle throughout the day. You won't even taste the difference, but your muscles and joints will feel the boost. For dinner, steamed broccoli and red bell peppers with a drizzle of olive oil. Healthy fats help your body absorb every drop of vitamin C. Finish the day with a cup of warm water and lemon before bed to aid overnight recovery. This simple routine delivers well over 500 milligrams of vitamin C, exactly what your body needs to rebuild, strengthen, and recover while you sleep. Now, although there are certain supplements you should never take at all or even late in the day, as a senior looking to build muscle, which I'll reveal later in this video for maximum muscle recovery and growth, you must take vitamin C supplements before breakfast. Because if you only take your morning meals without fueling your body with vitamin C first, you're missing a crucial step. 
This vitamin helps jumpstart collagen production, supports muscle fiber repair, and enhances how well your body uses protein for strength. But here's the catch. Vitamin C alone isn't enough to truly rebuild and maintain strong muscles, especially after your morning walks, you need to pair it with the next supplement I'm about to share with you. Because this next one, probiotics, works hand in hand with vitamin C to improve nutrient absorption, reduce inflammation, and maximize your muscle recovery results. Number two, probiotics. During digestion, your gut acts as the command center for how your body absorbs nutrients. But here's what most people don't realize. No matter how many supplements or protein shakes you take, if your gut health is poor, your muscles never get the full benefit. Probiotics restore the balance of good bacteria in your digestive tract, which directly controls how well your body uh, absorbs protein, uh, vitamin D, and essential amino acids, all key nutrients for muscle building. When your gut microbiome is healthy, nutrient absorption stays active for up to eight hours after eating, allowing your body to rebuild and strengthen muscle fibers efficiently. But when you're lacking healthy gut bacteria, uh, a problem that affects nearly half of all seniors, your digestion slows, inflammation increases, and your muscles receive up to 50% less protein from the food you eat. This makes recovery slower and muscle gains much harder to achieve. Probiotics also help reduce bloating, improve sleep quality, and enhance your body's natural production of growth hormones, especially when combined with vitamin C and proper rest. Each probiotic capsule delivers billions of live cultures that repopulate your gut with beneficial bacteria, giving your body the power to digest, absorb, and rebuild muscle tissue effectively. This is why seniors with strong gut health wake up feeling lighter, more energized, and noticeably stronger, while those with poor gut balance often feel sluggish and weak despite eating well. A groundbreaking study tracked 150 seniors over a 12-week period to examine how probiotics affect muscle growth and recovery. Those who took a daily probiotic supplement containing lactobacillus and bifidobacterium strains showed a 32% increase in muscle protein synthesis and recovered from exercise nearly 40% faster than those who didn't. Researchers found that probiotics don't just improve digestion, they activate key gut muscle pathways that help your body absorb amino acids and essential nutrients more efficiently, directly fueling muscle repair. In fact, ancient Japanese healers used fermented foods like miso and kefir to restore vitality and physical strength after illness or fatigue centuries before modern science confirmed the gut's role in muscle recovery. To maximize probiotic absorption, take your supplement before breakfast with a full glass of water when your stomach acid levels are low and live cultures can thrive, setting your body up for better digestion, stronger muscles, and faster recovery all day long. However, taking vitamin C and probiotics alone uh, won't do much for your muscles if you're pairing them with the wrong morning foods. The next three foods I'm about to reveal could silently sabotage your muscle building progress. And the last one is something most seniors eat every single morning. After analyzing dozens of nutrition studies and working with experts in muscle preservation and gut health, I've identified the three foods you must avoid before breakfast if you want your supplements to actually work. These foods can weaken your gut balance, spike inflammation, and block nutrient absorption, making your vitamin C and probiotics almost useless. The number one food you should never eat before breakfast if you're serious about building or preserving muscle is soy milk. Soy milk. At first, this might sound surprising. After all, soy milk is often marketed as a healthy, plant-based alternative packed with protein. Many seniors drink it daily, believing it supports muscle and bone health. But here's the hidden truth. Soy milk can actually slow down muscle growth, especially as you age. Soy contains phytoestrogens, uh, plant compounds that mimic estrogen in the body. In high amounts, these can lower testosterone, the key hormone responsible for muscle growth and repair. This effect becomes more pronounced in seniors where natural testosterone levels are already declining. Even though soy provides protein, it's low in methionine, an essential amino acid your muscles need for recovery. Without enough of it, 
your body struggles to build lean muscle. On top of that, soy also contains phytates, compounds that block your absorption of vital minerals like zinc, iron, and magnesium, the very nutrients your muscles depend on for strength and repair. For some people, soy can also disrupt gut balance, leading to bloating or inflammation that makes it harder for your body to absorb nutrients from other foods. So while soy milk may seem like a healthy choice, drinking it regularly can interfere with hormone balance, mineral absorption, and muscle recovery, making it one of the worst healthy habits for seniors trying to build or preserve muscle. A 2021 review examined how soy consumption affects muscle growth in older adults, and the results were striking. Seniors who regularly drank soy milk showed lower testosterone levels, slower muscle recovery, and reduced protein synthesis compared to those consuming whey or other non-soy proteins. In simpler terms, their bodies were missing the hormonal and amino acid support needed to build muscle effectively. And it doesn't stop there. The phytoestrogens in soy act like weak estrogens in the body, and when consumed often, they can suppress testosterone even further, the very hormone that drives muscle repair and strength. This hormonal imbalance can lead to fatigue, slower recovery, and increased fat storage over time. Soy milk also contains phytates, which bind to important minerals like zinc and magnesium, two nutrients essential for rebuilding and maintaining strong muscle tissue. For seniors already prone to deficiencies, this can quietly sabotage their progress. I'll never forget Harold, a 79-year-old client who came to me puzzled. He walked daily, ate plenty of protein, and even drank soy milk thinking it was helping his heart and muscles. Yet, he kept getting weaker. After switching in from soy milk to fermented dairy and plant proteins like pea and rice, within a month he gained back three pounds of lean muscle and felt stronger during his walks. The lesson is simple but powerful. If you want to build muscle as you age, avoid soy milk, swap it out for better protein sources like Greek yogurt, eggs, or a plant-based protein shake made without soy. Your hormones will rebalance, your muscles will recover faster, and your strength will return. The second thing you should never consume at night if you're a senior trying to build muscle is energy drinks. Now, energy drinks are often marketed as quick fixes for fatigue and performance boosters packed with caffeine, taurine, and B vitamins. And yes, they may give you a temporary burst of energy, but when it comes to muscle building and recovery, especially in seniors, they can quietly destroy your progress. Here's why. Energy drinks spike cortisol, your body's primary stress hormone. Elevated cortisol at night prevents your body from releasing growth hormone, the key hormone responsible for repairing and rebuilding muscle tissue while you sleep. Without it, your body can't properly recover from even light exercise, and instead of gaining strength, you lose it over time. They also interfere with deep sleep. The caffeine in most energy drinks can stay active in your system for up to eight hours disrupting slow wave sleep, the exact stage where muscle recovery, tissue repair, and hormone balance occur. Seniors who consume caffeine too late in the day often wake up tired, sore, and weaker even after a full night in bed. Energy drinks are also loaded with sugar or artificial sweeteners, which trigger um, insulin spikes that block fat burning and cause inflammation in muscle tissue. Chronic inflammation makes your muscles less sensitive to amino acids, meaning you can eat all the protein you want. Your body just won't use it effectively. I'll never forget Elaine, a 74-year-old retired nurse who came to me feeling drained and frustrated. She walked every morning and ate clean, but still couldn't build strength. After digging deeper, we found she drank one can of energy drink every evening for a boost. Once she replaced it, with water and an herbal tea, her sleep quality improved, her muscle soreness dropped, and in just three weeks, she started regaining her energy and strength. The lesson is simple. Energy drinks don't build energy, they steal it. If you want stronger muscles and better recovery, skip the late night caffeine and let your body rest naturally. Drink water, get your protein, and allow your body's natural repair cycle to work the way it's meant to. The third food you should never eat at night if you're trying to build or preserve muscle is white bread. Now, most seniors think of white bread as harmless, 
It's soft, easy to digest, and pairs well with soups or tea. But when it comes to muscle building, especially after age 60, it quietly works against you. Here's why. White bread is made from refined flour, which means all the fiber, vitamins, and minerals have been stripped away. What's left is a high glycemic food that causes your blood sugar to spike rapidly. These constant sugar surges trigger insulin resistance, making it harder for your muscles to absorb uh, amino acids and nutrients from your meals, and without proper amino acid uptake, your body can't synthesize new muscle fibers, no matter how much protein you eat. It gets worse. The blood sugar roller coaster caused by white bread can also raise cortisol, the same stress hormone that breaks down muscle tissue for energy. This effect is especially damaging at night when your body is supposed to be in anabolic repair mode, building, not breaking down muscle. Instead, your body diverts energy to managing those glucose spikes, leaving your muscles starved of the nutrients they need for recovery. A 2021 study found that older adults who ate high glycemic foods like white bread before bed had 34% less nighttime growth hormone release compared to those who avoided them. That means slower recovery, weaker muscles, and more fat gain around the midsection. The exact opposite of what you want. I'll never forget George, a 76-year-old retired coach who came to me confused. He walked daily, took his supplements, and drank his protein shakes, yet his muscle tone was fading. After reviewing his diet, we found his nightly habit, two slices of white bread with honey before bed. Once he swapped them for a small bowl of oats and berries, his energy improved, his morning stiffness disappeared, and within a month, he began regaining lean mass. The takeaway is simple. White bread feeds your cravings, not your muscles. If you're serious about building strength and staying independent, cut it out, especially at night. Replace it with fiber-rich carbs like oats, quinoa, or sweet potatoes to fuel real lasting muscle repair while you sleep. Which of these foods have you been unknowingly eating at the wrong time? Drop a comment below and let me know. I read every single one and I'm genuinely curious about your experiences. If you're serious about finally rebuilding strong toned muscles, no matter your age, I've created something special just for you. My 30 day senior muscle revival meal plan includes over 90 high protein probiotic friendly meals designed to fuel recovery and strength. Each recipe is carefully built to avoid muscle sabotaging foods like white bread and soy milk, and instead boost performance with zinc rich meals, morning probiotics and vitamin C combinations that actually work. Plus you'll get exact timing strategies to ensure your body absorbs every nutrient efficiently from your breakfast vitamins to your post-walk recovery meals. You'll find the link to this comprehensive plan in the pinned comment or description below. And trust me, your muscles will thank you. Tomorrow, I'm revealing a secret that will completely change how you think about senior muscle recovery. This simple nutrition hack has been clinically proven to boost muscle repair by over 30%, and it doesn't involve a single workout. I'm sharing this powerful insight exclusively with my subscribers first. So if you haven't hit that subscribe button yet, do it right now. You don't want to miss tomorrow's video. Trust me, this recovery secret will surprise you and you've definitely never heard it anywhere else. See you tomorrow.